Hey guys. So today, oh yeah, and if you guys are wondering why this is half open, my, my bugs some OCD people, but it's because they don't have a handle on it yet. They redid it. It's one of the people did. So, I'm sorry if it bugs you. I can't close it all the way or it'll be hard for me to open. I mean, I could still open it, but it would just be harder. So, that's why it's half open. Okay. Now, let's get on to the video. So the video today is I'm going to be doing a Topic Wednesday, and this week's theme is tips on starting YouTube yes. summer. Okay, I don't know why I saw this in my head. Anyway, so here are my tips, and this is just my tips, so you don't have to listen to them. I'm not a professional YouTuber. I don't have a lot of subscribers or anything, but basically my tips are Here's one of the biggest tips that I think, in my opinion, is like a very, very thing you have to do in order to be successful, is you have to have a consistent schedule. People need to know when you're going to be posting. So they don't, you know, always are like, when are you posting? Are you going to post next? And, you know, because it bugs people. Like, they need to know and you need to be able to, like, post on YouTube and not just be like the people who post once in a while and never post again until, like, a month later. And don't be those people. I mean, it's okay if you have two channels and you do that on one of your channels, like I do, but have a main channel where you post all the time or have like a set schedule. It's okay if you have two. Um, also, be yourself. I know that's very like, you. that's very genuine or not genuine, that's very general, like a lot of people should know that. But just be yourself and don't be afraid to like embarrass yourself. Just be you and people like you for you. Don't be afraid to be too cringy or anything. Just be who you are. And if you're a good new person, that's okay. People will like you no matter what. There will only be people in this world who will like you and support you and be here for you. Don't worry. I didn't think I was ever going to get to 200 subscribers. And now I'm at like 200, almost 300, I think. Pretty close. Um, so, I mean, that's still not that good, but it's good for me. And I'm happy with where I am at this point. I want more, but at the same time, I'm still like, trying to gain it. And do what you love to do. Like, try to do the trend as well, because those get more popular and stuff. But also do what you love. If you don't enjoy a trend that's going around YouTube, don't do it just because it's a trend. I mean, it's better if you do do it because it gets more views and stuff, but at the same time, you don't have to. Do what you love and people will watch you no matter what. Just, and also the thumbnails. Oh my God, these are another big thing. Thumbnails and the titles. Do not clickbait because nobody likes clickbait. I know there are a lot of YouTubers out here who do clickbait, but if you're going to do clickbait, do it at least in a way that is still sort of related to the video. Don't do totally clickbait. Like, I have a boyfriend, and then none of the videos about you making a craft. Like, no, 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 no. If you're like, I have a boyfriend, and then you talk about like a question in um, Q&A, and it's like you're talking about a boyfriend, but you really don't have a boyfriend, and it's just a question about a boyfriend, and then you want to say that, that's okay. I mean, still you shouldn't clickbait, but that's at least better clickbait than the other way around. Um, so, those help, but just try to find like really entertaining or really intriguing titles to put up so people want to click on your video and really nice good thumbnails that's that summarize what the video is about so yeah those are my tips just be yourself and make sure you look presentable too you don't want to look like a free you know you don't want to look horrible you don't want to have stuff in your teeth you don't want to be like horrible hair i mean you, you don't have to look like pretty pretty because you're not like going for a job interview or anything and it's like be yourself but more me than unless you're doing like vlogs vlogs are more like who cares what you look like more just be you know your day and go about your day but for actual like videos like these sit down videos you have to be more presentable not completely presentable just more like you know you know don't have messy hair don't have like you know things in your teeth when you're talking or anything like that so yeah those are my tips hope you guys enjoyed if you did give it a thumbs up sorry this wasn't that long of a video but those are just my tips comment down below some tips you guys have if you guys have youtube channels if you don't have a youtube channel and you want to start one you should start one that's my opinion. But make sure you have time. That's one of the biggest tips. Make sure you have time to have a consistent schedule that you know you can contain. And you will not keep missing days. Because nobody likes YouTubers like that who are inactive and don't post a lot because then you will get on. And people will unsubscribe and be like, you're not posting a lot so I'm going to unsubscribe and then that will just go downhill for you. So, yeah. And I know you can change your mind like you want to do YouTube at one point and then you can change your mind. And that's okay too. You can, It's okay to quit. But... If you're gonna start something, I would say don't go in. Like, start it to know that you're gonna keep it. Okay, so yeah. 
subscribe, and then you can go and buy yourself.